Hi guys and what is going on? So today I'm going to be doing a sort of installation slash tutorial on how to actually install um, weapons slash weapon sound. Someone um, recommended and um, asked me to do this. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and make a video on it. So pretty much what you're going to, all, all you're going to need is obviously open IV because obviously that's what you need to do weapons and other things like that to get into the main files of GTA. And you're obviously going to need a copy of GTA 5. Now I don't know whether this, you know, I don't. I have a legit version, so I'm just going to go the way of doing the legit Steam version. So all you need to do is open IV, go to Windows. Obviously, if you haven't got Open IV um, already, um, just go ahead and download that. It should have a step by step on how to do so. Then what you want to do is obviously go online, for instance, and get a mod. So I'm going to download this one. That. Right, then we're going to get this and we're going to open this. Just drag and drop these to the desktop. Then from here, to download this one, we're going to go to Update, X64, DLC Pack, as you can see the path up here. Patch Day 3, DLC, X64, Models, CDI Images, or CD Images, sorry, uh, Weapons. So, let's see, we can, there you go, there's the path, just to show you again, so if you need to pause the video, you can just view it up here, it's the directory, update, x64, DLC packs, patch date 3, DLC, x64, models, CDI images, weapons. So once you're in here, what you're going to obviously want to do is, these are the ones you want to obviously install, so you're going to hit this, you're going to copy, uh, sorry, you're going to rename, this is what I do. I do this so it's much easier to find. And you go into edit and you're going to, for instance, replace it. But first, what I'm going to do is I'm just going to quickly make a folder called uh, Backup um, 5. And what you'll do is, for instance, before doing it, just go ahead and find the folder if I can. Where is it? There it is. Backup. Can't even find it. I've got so many folders. There we go. So you just go and hit that, and then that is then saved. Once that's saved and extracted, just double check it's in there, which it is. Right click, replace, desktop, scroll down to the bottom, and it should be here. If you can't find it, uh, or there's too many of them, like you've got two, just make sure you've got the right one, which is the magazine. Then that one is done. Then you can obviously go ahead and delete that. Next one. Just copy it in here, put it in there, extract, then there we go, back at five. Then you can replace it, just like this. Now personally, um, I would say, I don't know what I've done there, um, I would say, um, obviously back up. But me personally, I don't back up, um, because most of the mods I use, like, I know what I'm doing, so I prefer not to, like, because I do constantly mod um, videos and showcases, um, I don't bother to back up. Um, but I wouldn't go by like just me. To, don't say, um, oh yeah, he doesn't back up, so I'm not going to back up. I would just say back up. But that's my personal point of view. I've been doing this for a long time, so there's hardly any time where I'm going to do anything wrong. And I'm constantly updating my models, constantly every single day. So there's never a time where I'm going to have the original models for the guns I'm, you know, I'm doing. But if you know, obviously, if you're not doing what I'm doing then just go ahead and back it up so once that's done that should pretty much all be done what I'm gonna do now is I'm gonna load up the game and yeah see if it worked so I've just gone to GTA now we're gonna what we're gonna do is obviously we're gonna see which one it replaced which is the Desert Eagle so we're gonna open it and there you go it's done it's simple as that all you need to do is drag and drop the uh, folder for the file sorry uh, remember to back up and yeah, that's pretty much it. And you've got yourself a remodel of the Desert Eagle to the Magnum 44. I hope you guys have enjoyed this quick, this quick tutorial. Um, like I say, someone requested it, so I went ahead and made a video. Because a lot of people don't actually know how to do these um, replacements of uh, models and stuff. And they end up mucking it up and obviously having to reinstall GTA. So I hope this has uh, helped and hope this doesn't make you go ahead and ruin your GTA files and actually helps and... 
make sure you do it the right way. So I hope you guys have enjoyed this video and I'll see you guys in the next one.